Why does everyone complain? Ooh. Hey guys, and welcome back to another business vlog. Tips, thoughts, musings, advice, actionable stuff that you can take away into your business today. So, today I want to deal with a subject that's very sombre. It's one of my pet hates, and that is the subject of complaining. So, so many people complain about stuff, and it literally does my head in. I don't really understand it. I think it's probably because it's easier to complain than to be positive in some psychological way, um, but it really just doesn't do anybody any good. Um, and actually, it's it's a, a fact, I'm pretty sure, although I'm not a doctor, that complaining releases stress hormones or stress, um, uh, yeah, it must be hormones, in your brain and therefore um, will make you feel worse. And then, actually, you can get that from other people complaining as well. So it's a little bit like secondhand smoke. If someone else is complaining around you, that can make, can make you more stressed too. So... Why does everyone complain? Oh, um, I'm not going to say that I'm perfect here, by the way, guys. I'm not some kind of weird martyr that's saying I'm always right. And believe me, if you spoke to my wife, you'd probably think, why are you doing this? Um, but actually, this is about business, right? And this is about teams and it's about creating culture. And one of the things that frustrates me most in my business is when I hear people complaining. Um, as this is kind of a tip or a, a, an advice vlog, then my uh, advice to you when you hear people do that is to try and help them um, turn that complaint into something positive. So think of something which is a, com uh, a complaint and create a solution from it. So rather than just sitting around and miring a problem, talking about it, actually come up with something that's going to improve it. Uh, I was watching a, a Gary Vaynerchuk vlog the other day and he said something which was so poignant, which was, if I told you that you were gonna die this week, would you still spend the rest of the week complaining? I doubt it. And if you do, we probably shouldn't be friends. Um, but there are, I'd say, the the vast majority of people enjoy complaining more than um, than seeing the positive in life and create an, creation of a positive culture. And that is frustrating for me. I'm someone that's driven by positivity. Um, I feed off it. If I'm around positive people, I just it drives my energy when immediately that I'm around someone complaining it just brings me straight down to earth and that's a real problem for me I'm running a business you know naturally you do get people that are around you that do complain and you have to kind of deal with that um, and I deal with that the best way I can and unfortunately Liz probably gets the the brunt of it when I get home at night but um, that is the way it is uh, and all I can do to try and improve that situation rather than complain about it, is to try and coach those people on how negative that is for not just them, but for other people as well. So next time, oh, I should say this as well, quick test, self-awareness, how many, check, do a check on yourself. How much do you time do you spend complaining? You might not feel that you actually do spend much time complaining, do you though? So now, start today, start writing down how many times you spot yourself complaining about something. Just note it down and see, and let me know how you get on, because uh, I'll be very, very interested um, in finding out a bit more. So that's it, guys. Stop complaining. Doesn't hurt, help anybody. Come up with positive solutions to things. And until then, I'll see you next time.